I was having some issues with starting my stream and it is now fixed. So, yay! Alright. So. Hey, Anna. Uh, sorry, I was having some trouble starting my stream. It kept saying there was no connection to internet. I'm like, really? So I like uninstalled my Streamlabs and it's been a hassle for the past like half hour, but finally. Uh, let's let's make let's make this armature. Um, so I pulled her out so I kind of know the length to do, you know, because it's gonna be smaller than um, Alderman, obviously. So like, just kind of gonna start. I I took two piece or one long piece of wire and I folded it in half to start there. And then now we're gonna. Start with the head to make a neck. How you doing today, Anna? gauge where to start the shoulders. amazing a little a little tired um had an organizer at the house today and we were organizing the closet so uh, so that is all done and organized and i get to finally start on this it's exciting how's your day today Awesome. That's right. Remember that. Awesome. I hope you have a great time. We have head, and then neck, and then we're gonna have the big broad chest, and he'll have the arms come down here, and then taper down into the tummy. Probably make this a little longer. I think I think the body is like twice as long as the head and neck, something like that. So it needs to it needs to go. 
a little longer. Not that one. This one. So today, um, is this is this going to be his name, Bran? Is this what you're referring to? I just twist it with my hand. That seems to work just fine. Seems to be good, so now we will do the do the legs. same with here's the shoulders or as close as possible nice dragons for sure this should be a good I think good size head neck body and then I'll attach the tail really Sebastian now is the time oh the gardeners yes the gardeners. that's why he's barking Sebastian, stab it. You just stab it. I need to make a Sebastian icon. When I'm able to make more icons. <laughs> Right. 
Let us make some arms and a tail and see if we need to make them shorter or not. And I probably should look up a pose, some kind of prowling pose of something, so I can get this right. And then so it doesn't look funny. Oh yes, yeah, he's gonna be nice and thick up here and then come thin and then have a nice big fat tail again. Yeah, and a big big hefty beard, Viking beard. Not sure yet what the rest of his details are gonna be, but that I know for sure. Not one to be messed with. How are you enjoying New York City so far, Anna? <clears throat> I thought it was pretty cool. It was pretty darn crowded though, for my taste. And we also walked from uh, the Trade Center all the way up to Times Square. <laughs> it was a really long walk. Very tired at the end.
Come on. Be a big picture, please. Oh, that's even better. try and uh, <laughs> and copy that post. Let's see. This one, this foot is back though. It's okay. I can live with it. Just got to figure it out. I wish I could see the bones. What are the bones doing? You know? Uh, coming down, coming out, and then coming back. Question. 
Dab it. Sorry. Lawn guy is here. Sebastian does not like the lawn guy. Barking. Hey, Guinevere. Hey, Osiris. How are you two doing today? Oh my gosh, they won't stop. See, what's funny is she's barking at him. Cleo's barking at Sebastian, who's barking at the lawnmower guy, who's not even in the bark yet. In the, or the bark. <laughs> in the back yet. So it's going to get worse as soon as he gets back there. Stop it, you two. Sebastian. Sebastian. What are you doing? What are you doing? Come on. Come on. What are you doing? Hey. Come here. Oh. What? Hey, hey, hey. You're acting weird. What's wrong with you? What'd you do? Did you hurt yourself? Oh. I'll have to see what's wrong with him. You guys are having a great day today. Guinevere and Osiris. Hey, thanks for the host, Osiris. from going where I don't want it to go, at least right now. And then deal with it later. You stay there. I want you to stay there.
I can get these arms even, and then I'll bend it however I want it. Playing Borderlands too fun. That's such a great game. There's like nothing wrong with that game. <laughs> I am excited. I fixed an issue with my computer. Apparently my drivers were not up to par. And so my game I was trying to play with JJ has been lagging and it's been no fun. So fixing that problem. kidding. I didn't realize because somehow, some way, my NVIDIA driver, the thing that searches to see if I'm updated on my drivers, it not, wasn't on my computer anymore. I don't know why. Not really sure how it happened. So yeah. Human one, machine zero. Yes. That's right. I knew it was weird and something was off. Because I was like, I should be able to play any game I want at any setting I want. Like, I got an okay computer. It's not, it's not, it's not bad. Finagling wires. Did I have to sneeze? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry about that. this is looking 
like this flow is nice I just need to fix these feet something is just makes my eyeballs feel funny Sweaty. <laughs> this is his art.
So I'll just connect that with foil. The front is lower than the back because his arms are, um, they're bent. So it, it, it made his front go down. It's like, why does it look funny? I was like, oh yeah, they're bent, so his front is down. Um, and the, the back's kind of, I think with the, the back legs. Does it, does it look normal? Does it look good? Or does it still look funny? I can keep working on it if it looks funny. make the front end arms longer if or does that look okay I'm not the best at anatomy so there but I mean I, I have the picture I was looking at seems to look okay we have nice shape here for the legs This arm is slouched down a little more because he's doing the whole paw in the air thing. So yeah, all right. I think we have a, a start. And as long as that looks okay and no weird proportions out of proportion. No, no, feet. solid standing. It's not like lopsided anywhere. It's not gonna fall. That's good. Yay! Okay, so that's done. That's, that's the hard part. Just so all of you are aware of what the hard part is. Right there. This. The rest is just covering this up. Which is not hard at all. It's just time consuming. <laughs> um... That requires me to move things so we do not mangle things. You get to look at babies. Babies galore. Oh, and for those who don't know or haven't seen it, Rudy's got some cool little stones on him now and a little stone tummy and a little bit of moss. Yeah. Rounds him out nicely. Okay, I'm gonna put him right there. Okay, uh, this is kind of the fun part right here. I like doing this part. I like the way his arms are placed, so let's tape them in where they're at. So that way when I put foil on them, they're not going to go anywhere. The hope. That's the hope. I could be totally wrong, and it's just going to shift all over the place. Yeah, 
that as tail. I should probably do that with the tail too. Alright, tail. Like a diaper. We're just gonna put a little diaper on you. Alright, catch you later. I'm just gonna finish this up and then uh, tomorrow I think we'll start putting some skin on him. I hope anyhow. Have a wonderful night. So what I'm going to do is just kind of basically cover everything first. Just like, just get the metal covered and then I'll work on bulking it up. Can do that in a bunch of different, um, a bunch of different times.
probably also going to have a nice ridge to his back. So we can also add that in. I'm just kind of adding layers here till he's about to stick because I want him. Uh, hopefully, it looks good. Um, I mean, clay can bulk up a lot of this, so that'll that'll help too. But. I use the tape to keep the uh, keep the foil where I have it. If I have it somewhere, I like it. I can always add more layers later, but 
for now just the, uh, the outermost pieces to keep them from unraveling. A real easy way to do the leg. <laughs> uh, let's see. Just kind of start and work your way down. didn't work out. <laughs> what happened there? Just cover the foot. That's all you have to do. You have one job. Do it. Cover the, cover the foot. And then wrap around. doesn't have to look pretty. <laughs> it just has to cover it.
guess it doesn't want to go there. was a lot easier. Okay. <laughs> I knew that was going to fall off. It's okay. I hope I have the anatomy of this right. I really do. It's really fun, and I don't want to botch it up and make it look like it just looks funny.
Cool. Cool. Okay. Compare. So I'll just need to... Uh... Got a little... Perhaps. This is cool. He's got some some neat some neat shapes going on that I'm digging for his for his final project. Final oh, what's the word? The final product. <laughs> I guess. I like this thing going on in his back. I'm gonna make that a nice big spike ridge right there. And he's gonna have the wings coming up. Sebastian. <laughs> How freaked out Sebastian. Sorry, baby boy. I didn't mean to scare you. I 
I would just use clay to thicken that up too. I'll wait on that. Keep working on this. Yes, it is alive. I hope it looks okay. <laughs> we got we got one paw coming forward. One paw um, pulled back. And then one foot coming forward, one foot going back. And uh, and then the tail coming down. And he's going to be like he's got going to have this really cool ridge on his back. And a nice thick chest. <clears throat> Does it look alright so far? And what I'm doing right now, just finishing up covering all the foil with tape. Hey, Namato! Splash! We are almost done with this armature. And then tomorrow I can start covering it.
but yeah, I'm really digging this post so far. Um, I tried not to make it too much larger. I don't know if it just happened because, you know, it's not my norm. I tried to kind of take this as a gauge. It's like, okay, here's the head, there's the arms, there's the feet, and there's the tail. So he's, um, he's kind of just stretched out a little bit, but he shouldn't be, he'll be a little bigger. I mean, he's going to be the dad. So imagine here's the dad and here's the mom, you know. He's just kind of, he's standing so, like, okay, here, here we go. Here's a good example. Normally, Normally my creations are about like see this tall. So if this goes to here, so he's just his butt is a little bit bigger because then I add the tail on, you know. So he he's a little bit longer than I normally make. But oh well. And I'm actually gonna keep this for something. I don't know what yet. But for something. Yeah, I was trying to make it not too much bigger, but, oh well. And I think we're almost done. Yeah, bulkier. Yeah, he's going to have a, a nice thick chest, a nice ridge on his back. Um, probably probably come out in a big spike right here and uh, and then a nice long tail to finish it off um, not a very long neck thick neck to make him you know seem fierce there. do that with the tail yeah that looks fun, huh? Pretty sure he's standing. Yep. So, uh, let's see. Yes, the dragon equivalent of a football player. Because this is going to be Dad Viking. So, Dad Viking needs a little heft. To him.
That's a nice thicker leg. Very time consuming, but very rewarding when it's done. This is my third armature I've ever made, I think. Third? Is it my third? So I'm uh, hoping I'm getting better and faster at doing it. to make make the shapes that the animal is you know at least best I can I'm not like a pro at anatomy but um, working on it it's all I can it's all I can do is keep trying and hopefully with each one it gets better Thickened up his tail nicely. Nice thick, nice thick back legs too. Yay! Cool. He found something really funny in his room. I bet it's a meme. <laughs> it usually is. I really like the prowling pose. Just saying. I like it a lot. It makes me happy. I hope I'm doing it justice. Like a real 
all fierce looking, you know? Like raw. Covering him tomorrow. Probably see what tomorrow is Saturday. Probably. I think I'm gonna start early. So uh, 8 a.m. probably. Pacific time. I don't know why, but I've been dreading doing this. But like now that I'm, now that I've done it, I love it. I don't know why I'm so scared to do stuff. It's fear of the unknown is what it is. I'm afraid I'm gonna butcher it, <laughs> but I didn't, so yay. Give me some more confidence to do more. Right? Right. His kneecap needs some tape. The back of his knee needs some tape. Okay, I do believe I do believe he's done. He's got leg here, leg, and then it's nice and thick. And almost happened. Almost jammed my toe. <laughs> Just give me a big loud, I did it, <laughs> and then I'll know. And then no, purple. Every purple toe, want to cut it off. Pinky toes shouldn't exist. JJ added a, because uh, we did some organizing today in our closet and we took something out. He wanted it in his room. So I'm like, okay, cool. Enjoy stubbing your toe on that. So we're waiting for the it happened screech of pain. Because it doesn't really fit the best where he put it, but whatever. All right. What do you guys think? I think it's great. Oh, thank you, JJ. <laughs> Gosh, so supportive. Look. It is. I yeah. Smaller than Alderman. Smaller than Alderman, but yet slightly bigger than a normal normal dragon. <laughs> so yeah, this ought to be all right. I like. I really like the uh, the Blake. pose. Yeah. See, look. I'll show you on the. That's where I was going. Oh, with. that's what you're doing. Yeah. So I was just kind of trying to make that happen somehow. <laughs> I think I got it. Pretty sure. Hand reaching forward, head turned. Yeah. And then back that one. Yeah. You know, if we had a fish bowl, we could, we, you could do fish cam still. <laughs> fish cam. <laughs> like right here. Yeah. And yes, guys, I am still working on trying to figure out fish cam. 
I gotta make it happen. It needs to happen. Make it happening. Make it happening. <laughs> All right. So this is now done. Tomorrow morning, probably at eight o'clock, most likely is when I'm gonna start covering him. So this is gonna be a several day process. As we know from the last ones I did. But worth it. We also know that because they do look pretty darn epic. They just take a long time. So you guys, thank you so much for watching. Have an amazing evening and I'll catch you guys tomorrow. See you later.